guest is a very beautiful actress, and she's in a TV series. It's called The Secret Circle, which airs Thursdays on The CW. Take a look at this. Why does he have our birthdays? What does it all mean? That Jake's grandpa is crazy. No offense. Don't take him. Yeah, and that we have to find the crystal and get out of here before he comes back and kills us. Again, no offense. The last time I saw him was when he crashed my parents' funeral, screaming about the end of the world. My aunt said that after they died, he just completely fell apart. Well, at least he's kept himself busy. <laughs> I think I just broke my pants. I know you did. <laughs> Please welcome the lovely Phoebe Tonkin, everybody. Phoebe Tonkin. I'm very well. You look very, very nice. This show looks sensational. Thank you very much. Are you, uh, are you vampire hunters? No, okay. I'm a witch. You're a witch? I'm a wicked witch. Do you do, do you, what, what do you do that's wicked? Well, I'm a, just a bit of a mean girl, and I, you know, set fires and bully other witches. That just makes you a jerk. <laughs> in real life. Oh, no, I know. I, play I, mean girl. No, no, I know. I understand. I don't think you're a mean person. You're, like, I've met uh, Sir Anthony Hopkins, who played Hannibal Lecter. He doesn't, doesn't eat, eat people. people. No, no. Good. <laughs> Maybe a little bit. A little bit. Of kind of, ooh, that's delicious. Yes. I've never done this before. Do I've what? never... <laughs> I've never done a talk show before. Oh, really? No, it's my first time. This, this is not really a talk show. <laughs> <laughs> Right, don't you mustn't. Uh, are you nervous? I was a little nervous that I was gonna fall. I'm a bit clumsy, and oh, I was just no, no, picturing no. myself walking across the stage. Oh and no, you know you're tripping no, you... over. We know we would edit that out. <laughs> <laughs> no With music. No, yeah, yeah, we'd put no. Uh, no, you'll be fine here. You mustn't worry. This is okay, very low key. It's not, you know, not important in any way. It's... <laughs> It would affect your career. <laughs> Neither up nor down. Where are you from? Is Australia. Oh, I got in some trouble with... I heard. Yeah. <laughs> Why is that? Well, I was uh, joking around a little bit with Guy Pearce, who's Australian. You yes. know, um, and we were joking a little bit. We said some mean things about the town of Canberra, which, as you probably know, is the capital of yes. Australia. And uh, people got very upset and thought that we were... You know, being mean about Canberra, which we were, to be fair. <laughs> and, uh, and now everyone in Australia likes Guy Pearce but hates me. <laughs> which is much the way it was before. <laughs> well, I can tell you now that I think my mum is so excited about being on this show that she's emailed probably everyone that I've ever met or that's taught me at school. So really? there's going to be a lot of people in a certain area of Australia to be watching this particular show. So uh, if I redeem... W would that area be the Canberra adjacent area? <laughs> it's a bit north. Which, which, which... Sydney. Sydney? Oh, yeah, I've been to Sydney. It's yeah. lovely there in Sydney and all other areas of Australia, including Canberra. <laughs> now, um, do you still live there? Or you, you no, moved to... I moved here. Right. I got an apartment about a month ago. Ooh. So, I mean, I've been in L.A. for a year, but, yeah, I got this apartment. So where did you live before the apartment? Well, I've been in Vancouver filming. Oh, right. Yeah, we That's moved... Canada, you that is... Yeah, yeah, yeah. That... <laughs> yeah, so I just got back on Friday. All right. I haven't even got internet. I haven't got anything. I've got, like, my couch, my bed, and my new puppy dog. Oh, that's lovely. Yeah, what kind of a dog is it? It's a Yorkie. Mm. It's called Bailey. Mm, doesn't redeem it. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I, I've known a couple of Yorkies in my life. They're, they're, they're snappy. They're so they... They're very bad-tempered. He's very small. I'm trying to potty train him at the moment, but he's... Potty train him? Like, yeah, on the, on the mats. Oh, right. I thought you meant an actual potty. I was like, I'll pay you. No, that is the next I'll step. pay to see that. I mean, if you can do that, I've got three dogs that want to meet you. <laughs> but he doesn't listen, because I, I, as I said, I got him on Sunday, but um, his name is Bailey. Right. But his name originally was Alejandro. I see. So well, you I changed his name. To, why? I, because it's. Or maybe yeah. he changed it. Did he change it? <laughs> yeah, he decided. I don't want to be called Alejandro. It's not going to work for me in Hollywood. <laughs> 
fancy stage name. So right. when I'm teaching him, I have to kind of go between calling him Bailey and calling him Alejandro, which is a bit harder to say quickly and... Yeah, but wait, uh, what are you training him to do? Oh, just to... Uh, just to be, What were you going to say? On the mat. Be there, mate. <laughs> Please. Yeah. Bailey. It's like, Bailey, pee here. Right. It's Alejandro, pee here. Well, what he might do is he might pee uh, under one name and completely disregard your instructions. <laughs> The poor dog may be leading a double life. He's the Jekyll and Hyde of small, annoying terriers. Did you, did you grow up with dogs? Did you have a, a rural upbringing, or uh, were you a city girl? No, I was a city girl. Mm -hmm. I went to, like, an all-girls high school. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if anyone told you, I'm a very creepy old man. I... No. <laughs> So, uh, yeah, that's nice. And then you uh, went to acting school after that? No, I started actually, I am playing a witch right now. I started as a mermaid. Oh. I think I'm being typecast in a certain. It's a kind of era. supernatural. Like no, but. Elf next. No, listen, no, you're a young, beautiful woman in Hollywood. You're a young actress. Uh, you're going to be asked to play supernatural characters because that's the way I it is the right fun now. Ones. Yes, and that's the way it is right now. You know, in my young day, it was uh, can you play the drunk guy in the bus station? <laughs> Oh, no, wait, I, I just actually one. was the drunk guy in the bus station. But, but it was, uh, but that's the thing now. Everybody, you know, the, uh, vampires. the vampires and yep. the witches and the werewolves. and yep. the, uh, Fairies, I, really? I think. Fairies? That could be my next job as a fairy. <laughs> Mermaid, witch, wizard. Right, yeah. Do you enjoy the Harry Potters? I do. Oh, me too, yeah. yeah. I'm a Gryffindor. Jeff's a Slytherin. <laughs> Did you... No, no, I'm definitely a fairy. <laughs> yeah, I know that, but you have to be a Gryffindor, a Slytherin, a Ravenclaw, or a Hufflepuff. <laughs> What's wrong with you, man? Relax, relax. All oh, right, yeah. <laughs> Did you read all the Harry Potter books? I stopped after the first one, but then I saw the movies. Not the same. I know. Not the same. I mean, like, in the movie, the third, The Goblet of Fire, the whole Cedric, Ador uh, Cedric Diggory subplot thing, it's gone. And where's Dobby? Nowhere. <laughs> He was the best. Dobby's great. Voldemort is terrifying. Yes. Without that nose. Yeah, like Jeff. No. <laughs> no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, we were in Scotland. People thought he was Voldemort. <laughs> <sighs> yeah. Well, listen, we're out of time. So, uh, what do you fancy? Mouth organ, awkward pause, or a big cash prize? Ah, big cash prize. What time is it, Jonathan? It's time David? for the big cash prize. Big cash prize. Fifty American dollars in quarters in a bag with a dollar on it. Two ways to win. You can either answer a question or you can guess what's in my box. Here's how that works. I imagine a box in my head, but I don't know what's in it. Only Jeff knows what's in it. So you guess what's in it. If you're right, Jeff will tell us. And if you're wrong, something awful will happen and oh. it'll be, uh, yeah, it'll be awful. Okay. Yes. Do I guess it? Oh, you want to do the, the, the box in my head? Sure. Or question. Question, question. Right. <laughs> I'm Australian. No, 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 no. Don't do, listen. Here's what I've learned. Yes. Don't badmouth Australia. I, I love Australia. And, and never badmouth Australia if you're Australian outside of Australia. They hate that. I wasn't bad. Mate. I know. You're very patriotic Australian, very. right? Very. Right. Greatest country in the world, right, mate? Yes. Yes. <laughs> Except, of course, for America and Scotland. After that, uh, in the top three, though. No. Right. First. No. <laughs> all right. All right. All right. Um, here's a question. Iceland is in the North Atlantic. Its capital city is Reykjavik. In the U.S., what percentage of pizzas are ordered with pepperoni on them? Is it 30%? Is it 40%? Or is it a whopping 50%? 30%? 40%? 50%. I'm trying to be sort of quiz showy. Oh, high five? No, I was oh, going to go like a buzzer. 50%. That's crazy. That's absolutely right. You won 50